it's time to do your interview. And it's either going to be here in the United States or abroad. But before you do that interview, it's very important that you prepare because certain things can cause you to be denied. For example, did you know that you could be charged or accused of alien smuggling even if it had to deal with your children? Let's talk about that today in this video. I'm attorney Jonathan Mendoza and for years I have helped people with their immigration cases and criminal defenses matters. Unfortunately, very often people come into my office where they have a loved one or somebody they know that has gone to their interview and denied. Why? Because during the interview, they made a statement such as when I entered the United States without permission, I was with this person. And so the officer who's interviewing you will then make you find, you find you inadmissible to enter the United States and thereby deny your, your application. Sometimes you're eligible for a waiver and sometimes you're not. But what the law states in general is that any type of assistance uh, in helping somebody or encouraging somebody to enter the United States illegally can be a ground of inadmissibility, alien smuggling. So even though you entered with your child, even though you entered with your spouse, which is very common, if that is, if that is discussed during your interview, you're going to be denied. So be cautious of that. Now, sometimes the officer may try to trick you. They'll look at your application and say, well, I see you have children. I see maybe one of your child has DACA. Well, DACA means that the child entered without permission. How did that child come to the United States? Maybe you are married and your spouse has no legal status. A discussion can happen with regards to how did that person enter the United States and when. And if you simply say, well, we entered together uh, in so-and-so date, denied, you've been found inadmissible based on alien smuggling. So you got to be very cautious about what you're saying, which is very important that you prepare for your immigration interview. Uh, what to look out for, any red flags, what to say and not to say, and in general, try to say very little. If a question can be answered with a yes and no, that's how you want to answer it. Don't start talking more than is necessary because sometimes that will have open a can of worms. So if you have an interview coming up, you really should talk to an attorney to be able to discuss your case, to be able to prepare you for the interview, including the medical examination if it's done abroad or even here, as to what you should and should not say and the types of questions you should be aware of. If in fact you have been found uh, inadmissible for alien smuggling, uh, there may be a waiver available for you, but again, you need to talk to an attorney to see if you qualify for that waiver and the evidence that has to be submitted to obtain it. All right, if you have any questions, as always, you can contact our office. We can set up a time to talk and see how we can help you. Thanks.